Hello, my name is Swiss Bianco. In this video I will talk about stippling. I did prepare a simple stippling project, uh, Beretta 92 grips. Uh, we see here in the middle there is already a bit stippling done compared to the regular uh, texturing that is on the grips. Uh, those are factory grips, it's just a plastic version like that is uh, used by say the US military and many others. Now on that version here, the other side there I did already stipple a bit more. Uh, in this case I did want to have the Beretta logo in the middle like it is and just go all the way out around the corners and then back up to have the outline that we see is already done. Then I wanted to have the outline on the holes for the screws and also the outline of the Beretta logo in the middle. So we see here this part here and that part here is not stippled and I'm gonna do that right now here so that we see how that looks. Uh, what I use is a simple soldering iron that I did alter that the stippling part gonna fit in front of it. Uh, the screw on the side is non-functional. Uh, what is uh, important is that the, the front part is threaded, uh, that the stippling part, uh, the the texturing part in front of it can be screwed in and that that sticks in there and hold on and can't come out anymore uh, because if that uh, is not completely fixed uh, then it may uh, stick with, uh, with the plastic as you stipple. So that was relatively easy to do. Now I just need to look how I do that best in front of the camera so that we see how that looks. Of course you would do that outside uh, because you see it's smoking a little bit of the burned plastic. So this is just for the camera that we see how that could work. And of course we would put the hands away and uh, the plastic part would be flat on a bench so you, that you don't get burned. Uh, this is really hot so you can burn yourself really easy if you uh, don't watch it. So I would not do that like this. That is just now for the video. That's basically how that gonna look like. If you have ridges a bit you can always slightly overstipple to get rid of the of the ridges there and that is how that looks now now that part is stippled the top part I have to do after the video there uh, if the stippling gets too aggressive for your hand then you can always use a bit of sandpaper and smoothen it out. Uh, just be careful with smoothing it out, not that you remove too much. Uh, that is a bit of process to remove a little bit and then uh, dry it in the hand and if it's still too rough then remove a bit more. Stippling is a great way, simple, inexpensive, to improve the grip on not only on firearms but pretty much on anything that is plastic that you need a, a secure grip on it that you uh, wanna wanna have more texturing so that is pretty simple. The inserts gonna come in different uh, shapes, different sizes, different texturing. So this is just a, a simple uh, waffle pattern that we have uh, for, for stapling here. Uh, in this case the fine one I did already make a video on that stippling insert the more coarse one uh, I still need to make a video uh, relative uh, related about that and uh, that is as you see it's pretty simple be careful about the, the fumes the 
smoke that comes it's burnt plastic so that is not healthy and of course it's a hot tool so uh, only touch it where it is uh, designed to the, the plastic handle and not the, the metal so that much about stippling on this Beretta 92 grips